Okay, everybody, hello. Welcome to today's purse sale. My name's Kim, I'm purse trippin', and I resell handbags, wallets, and I adjust lights constantly, trying to get the right color for you guys so you can see the exact color and, descri and description. The direct, oh my God, it's gonna be one of those days, you guys. Yep, need more coffee. Anyways, trying to adjust the light so you guys can see the bag in its entirety, colors and all that stuff. Um, I want to let everybody know that all sales are final if you decide to purchase from me. All items are pre-owned unless otherwise stated, and I ship only within the U.S., and I accept only PayPal. So I do ask you ask, I ask that you ask all questions before you purchase, because once I ship that bag out, it is yours. Um, that's just my policy. So... Hello everybody, hopping on right now. Um, also know that all my items that are for sale are in the description box, depending on what device you're on, how you find it, I'm not sure. If you're on the laptop, there's gonna be three little dots up in the right corner, you're gonna hit that, it's gonna drop the description box down and you're gonna see all my items that are for sale. I won't be telling you here the prices of the items, you'll just have to look out down in the description box to find out what is available and the prices okay so that's pretty much the majority it's very simple very easy hi cindy hello everybody hopping on good afternoon miss mama joe scott good afternoon sorry if i just butchered your name why did i just hear something squeak in my room like a little mouse that stormy might have brought as a surprise Please tell me I was hearing things. <laughs> oh yeah, Stormy brought me a lizard yesterday. It was a very sweet surprise. It's usually something almost every day, especially in the springtime. I get things we don't even want to talk about, but <laughs> cat life, right? Okay guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get started on the handbags and I'll be listing them as we go. You can check the description box as I'm talking to see, you know, the prices and you can purchase right now. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, okay, so I didn't really get to show this that well when I thrifted it. Um, and it's an exquisite piece. This is actually eel skin and it's ruche and it is actually a clutch wallet. So it's a larger wallet and I have thrifted and sold many eel skin, but never this fancy like this. Okay, so you can see the size of it. You can actually use it as a little clutch if you want, or you can use it as a large wallet in your bag. Magnetic snap closure, and this is what is so cool is, first of all, this is vintage, by the way, probably 19, late 70s, early 80s, I would say. Um, it's got all the information that says genuine eel skin here on the in the ID window. You can obviously take that out if you don't need if you don't want it in there and put your driver's license, whatever you want. Over here, you're gonna get one, two, three card slots, four card slots, five card slots. And then up here, you have this large pocket, a zipper clean compartment. And then a little bit dusty right there and then you also have this pocket that opens up and then I love this kiss lock coin compartment right here that's got a divider in the middle so this is going to be item number one my burgundy eel skin clutch wallet it's definitely got a um, sturdy snap on it this is not loose at all so just a little bit dusty but very pretty Okay, I'm gonna just close it like so. And there you have that. Happy Friday, Gina, that's for sure. Happy Friday. Okay, so item number one is the Eel Skin Clutch Wallet. Good 
morning, Marty. How are you? Welcome. I just showed the first item, so you made it just in time. Okay, number two. I know it's not for everybody, but I have purchased these and sold several of them in the past. The little sloth guy is a pack backpack purse. And uh, a lot of you guys seem to really love the little plush backpack. So I went ahead and I picked him up. He's in brand new condition. Um, you can wear it as an adult or a child because it is adjustable. It's the cutest little thing ever. If you have anxiety or you just need a little friend to carry with you, look how cute it is. Isn't that the cutest little guy ever? So it's adjustable and it can go really, really, really long. Like really long or it can go all the way up. So this is a little sloth plush. His belly is the storage area. I'm sorry, is that his belly? That's his back. Opens up and it's actually pretty roomy. You've got this whole entire area to put things in and it's super clean. Super, super soft. And this is gonna be item, look this way guy. Item number two. Isn't it cute? Oop. Okay, so item number two is my sloth plush backpack purse. Okay, no questions, you guys. If not, we're gonna go ahead and go on to item number three. I have this gorgeous black leather bucket bag. Excellent condition. Adjustable crossbody strap. Minimal hardware, it's like the only hardware I see is the little post adjustment right here. It's got the scalloped leather around the base, the bottom here. Drawstring closure. Oh, let me put it on and show you how it fits real quick. So it's a medium sized bucket bag. Very lightweight. And this guy is by J. Crew. J. Crew is a sister company to Madewell, and it still has the brand new with tags on it. Okay, the inside is raw leather with an open pocket. So new with tag, J. Crew leather bucket bag, and it also says J. Crew stamped. It's foil stamped, I believe, right? Where are you at? Oh, there you are. It's foil stamped right there, J. Crew. Gorgeous bucket bag. Okay, and that's gonna be item number three. And there's a long, 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 look at all the adjustments. So you can make it super long or shorter, whatever you like, and perfect condition. And that's gonna be item number three. Guys, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. If you see the little icon below this video, you'll see it right down there. There's a little thumbs up. If you can click on that when you come in, that would be awesome. I see there's 73 in chat and 31 thumbs up, and I really, really wanna thank you for that. Thank you, Mama Jo. Thank you so much. All right, let's do item number four.
I have an authentic Fendi clutch. And you can also, if you're not a clutch gal, you can also use this as a carry-all for the bottom of your purse. Try to get it up close where you can see the leather is gorgeous. Um, there is the, this is kind of hard to see. It's embossed Fendi on the label right here. This is actually genuine snake right here. A black pebbled leather. Beautiful, beautiful clutch. Has a zipper pocket. You can put your cell phone back here. The largest cell phone, it'll definitely fit. Or your keys, whatever, um, small catch items and then it pops open. And then this entire area is the inside and it's all leather lined. This is a vintage Fendi, by the way. Hopefully you can see in there and it's in beautiful, beautiful condition, except for there's a little bit of, um, you can't tell, but there's like a little bit of fading, barely. Can you see that? That's the only thing that's wrong with it. Here is the Fendi zipper pull. And then I'm going to show you this again real quick. It's hard to see with all the lights. There we go. No corner wear. And there we have that. And that's going to be number four, Fendi black leather clutch. Okay, the J. Crew has sold. Thank you very much for your purchase. Number three, J. Crew has sold. Okay, so now we're on to item number five. Awesome, Rachel, thank you so much. Um, please, I hope you for didn't forget to um, send your shipping address as well. If not, you can still, you can message me through PayPal if, you ha if that wasn't attached to the payment, but I did see your payment, so thank you so much. Okay, I have a vintage mini signature coach hobo and it's in excellent condition as well. I love that this bag has a tassel zipper pull, leather tassel zipper pull, and I love the detail on the shoulder strap. This is a very soft leather, white at the top for comfort, silver hardware, medium tote, or not tote, hobo, I'm sorry. It is got uh, leather corners, pebbled leather corners with an ivory contrast stitching. Okay, cute little tassel zipper pull. Here's the Creed. The inside is clean with a zipper compartment and a key, a little D-ring to hang your keys right there and two open pockets. Okay. Nice and slouchy, really cute coach and the signature C's are the tiny ones. Okay, so that's going to be number five, Coach Mini Signature C Hobo in black. All right, any questions? Now we're going to go on to number six. I 
I have this brown pebbled leather Michael Kors tote. And I would definitely say this is a large tote. Gold toned hardware. It's got the zip top closure. The interior has one large open pocket and it's nice and open so you can see all of your things when you open your bag. This is definitely a lightweight bag for it being pebbled leather. Okay, so this is going to be number six. Coach Brown Pebbled Leather Tote. Oh, I'm sorry, not Coach, Michael Kors. Michael Kors. Hello, welcome. How are you today? All right, we are on number seven. You know I had to pick this one up when I found it. Look how pretty this is. Beautiful condition. It's got the steer head that's all stitched with little um, studs all around in turquoise and gunmetal. Chain shoulder straps, studs on the straps. This bag retails for a <clears throat> hundred and I think it's like a hundred and thirty or a hundred and forty. It has studded pockets on each side. It's got a distressed leather look. Big pocket on the back and guys this right here for those who have been asking is a concealed carry pocket okay so that's a concealed carry pocket and this is just a little slip pocket to put whatever else you want in this is a Montana West we'll try it on first So it's got a nice strap drop length. Oh, don't know what you're saying. <laughs> okay. Put whatever you want in these little side pockets that's magnetic snapped. Car concealed carry, the perfect bag. It's by Montana West. The inside has a center zipper compartment there. Gunmetal hardware. I'll take all this stuff in out. <clears throat> Here's two slip pockets. Center zip compartment. And then over here you have another zip compartment. The Montana West logo. And this is going to be item number seven, Monta Montana West. see any questions coming through so that's a good sign everybody's got their questions answered I guess I'm explaining them well enough number eight number eight is this black vintage coach crossbody 
I've definitely sold this one in the past. It's a very smooth leather. It's got the flap. And here's the Creed on the inside. Thank you, Edie. I appreciate that. Still has the hang tag. Crossbody strap. Like a cute little satchel. And the strap is adjustable right here on this side and right here on this side. So it's smooth black leather. <clears throat> and it's going to be <clears throat> item number eight. Let's go to item number nine. <clears throat> Coffee. Vintage, authentic Christian Dior. I'll show you all the signs of authenticity as we go. So this is a crossbody, Christian Dior. <clears throat> so this is a jacquard fabric. It's got leather trim, black leather trim, and then the very light gold Dior clasps. The camera's washing it out. It's definitely a dark black with little stuff on there. But look at the attachment on this strap here. Okay, it says Dior on there. And then you've got the same on this side. Don't worry, I'll wipe it all down for you. This is just dust. And then the strap is a smooth leather. And here's the buckle. It is adjustable. Then you flip it over. You've got the information right here. Okay, that's the opposite side of the buckle. And this opens up and that's how you adjust the strap. Okay. And then you've got the little clasps that open. Leather interior. And it's worn. The foil has starting to wear, but you can see where it says Christian Dior made in Italy. Right there. Right there. And it is a smooth leather on the interior. Okay, this pocket over here is a little zipper pocket. Also leather on the inside, or canvas, actually this is canvas and this is leather. And I would call this a medium crossbody. So let me try it on for you. And these like pop down. Okay. And the side has got a nice, just like a nice, uh, probably like two inches. Put the little tabs in and I will show you what it looks like on crossbody. Okay, 
Okay, so it's a good size. It's not tiny. It's not huge, but it's not tiny either. All right, so this one's gonna be item number nine, Christian Dior crossbody in black. Okay, number 10. I've got this coach crossbody. And it's like a type of a grayish taupe background with a black signature C's. Okay, my coach of, let's see. The Coach Vintage Black Crossbody just sold, thank you. Number eight just sold. Alrighty, so back to this one. It's got the metal Coach label in silver. That's where you adjust the crossbody. A little bit of wear right here. Just right there, that's it. This is actually a newer coach. That is a zipper pocket. And then here is also the coach tag as well. And the bottom has a leather strip in case you want to set it down on the floor. Instead of feet, it's got the leather strip going across. Shoulder or crossbody it. Okay, so this is going to be coach number 10. I'm going to call it black and taupe, you guys, because it's kind of a taupey color, black and taupe. Um, signature C coach crossbody number 10. Okay, number 11. I have a Michael Kors satchel in black pebbled leather. Kind of a medium to a large size. Big pocket here on the back covers this whole area right here. Feet on the bottom. Zipper top closure. Super, super roomy interior. One, two, three, four, five open pockets and a center zip. A really really soft pebbled leather 
Okay, so this is going to be item number 11, Michael Kors Black Pebbled Leather Satchel. Okay, let's see. Do I have any questions, you guys? Please feel free to ask. Nobody's even chatting in the comments. 116 of you are in here. Nobody's talking to each other. 69 thumbs up. Can I get some more thumbs up, guys? That's great for my channel. Makes me know you're still alive and out there. <laughs> All right, let's see. What do we have now? Number 12. Gina, hi. <laughs> I've got a couple Patricia Nash coin card wallets for you. Okay, so here is, you can um, actually rewind to that area of the video and you can see it all again in the Dior. So this is brand new with tags, Patricia Nash coin key card charm wallet. Oh, right, right, Diane, I get it. Okay, so brand new with tags. Retail on this is $40. And what's really cool, if you wanna do for Christmas or something for somebody is, so everybody loves these. So all you have to do is if you want, if you didn't wanna give it just as this, you can get a um, gift card from somewhere, their favorite place, slip it in there, wrap it up and give it as a gift. It makes the perfect gift, you guys. So on the inside of this little coin purse is a credit card, two credit card slots, leather. So you can put your cards in there as well. Okay, and then this comes with it. It's the ID tag and all that good stuff. So this is my blue embossed Patricia Nash gunmetal coin card wallet. Number Okay, and now we have number 13 coming up. And it's the exact same style, but it's in a floral leather. Retail is exactly the same, $40. There's the keychains on it. If you buy a purse, yes, absolutely. If you get a purse with your coin wallet, um, don't send the shipping on the coin purse. It's just if you purchase the coin purse alone, then you would need to pay the shipping. So yeah, I, I definitely combine shipping on the coin slash purse um, purchase. Okay, so this is exactly the same. Brand new with tags by Patricia Nash, number 13. Do you have to turn your phone off and on again? Post, I'm not seeing the listings. Maybe I do it wrong, but I see the prices. I'm not sure what device you're on. That's why I can't answer those questions. It's something that depending on your device, it just depends on your device on how you see the prices. I wish I was able to answer for you, but I just don't have your answers for you because I don't know what you're on. And even if I do know you're on sometimes, I don't know. All I know is how to do it on my laptop. 
Okay, number 14 is, I cannot believe I found this brand, you guys. I was so excited because so many of you love the hair on hide, but you don't prefer it because it's real. This is a vegan brand, and it's a really cool vegan brand by, uh, the name again is Sinbono. You've probably heard of that before, and it's an exact, exact, they did so good on their vegan wear. It's so, so cool. So this is a hair on hide, but it's a vegan hair on hide, and it's so pretty. Now, the leather that looks like leather completely had me fooled. It totally looks like genuine leather. Even the strap and the making of these bags are so cool. It's brand spanking new. And what's really neat too is the inside is a faux suede, but you would never know the difference. Isn't it so neat? Okay, so one of the Patricia Nash just sold, but I don't know which one, so let me check. Let me check. And I do need to know which, if, if you didn't, I didn't check it, but if you did not put which Patricia Nash coin purse, then I'm not gonna know which one to ship you. If you don't have your shipping address or you don't have the correct item, then it's not gonna get shipped. Okay, so the floral, awesome. Thank you, Nell. I will mark the floral Patricia Nash sold. And that was number 13. Okay, so now this bag would be, if it were real, meaning real hair on hide, real leather, this would be about a $300 bag, but because it's vegan, it's definitely not gonna be that much. You can have the same look without real hide. So if you like this, then this is for you. You can also take the strap off. Cute little satchel. Okay, and it is by, again, it's by, I always forget the name, S-I-N-B-O-N-O, Sinbono zebra stripe okay number 14 Okay, I have this Michael Kors crossbody. It's a patent leather with the little MK circles on it and the plaque on the front. Gold chain hardware, tan leather crossbody strap. Medium size crossbody. Zipper top. Inside has a really large um, slip pocket and then two additional open pockets. So there's that there. And then you have two open pockets over here. So this is my Michael Kors patent leather crossbody. And the strap is adjustable. Okay, item number 15.
Okay, guys, do I have any questions? Any questions, guys? Any questions? <laughs> yes, Annette, you have a question? If so, fire away. Have any fossil? I do have fossil. I'm not going to show it today, but I do have fossil. The sun and the moon crossbody, did you sell it? No, I did not sell it yet. I was trying to decide if I wanted to keep it. But if I decide I want to sell it, you can just check the description box again and it'll be listed. Backpacks. Um, trying to see. Nothing, no backpacks that I can see anyhow. I know you probably want leather, right? Is that what I'm thinking? You'd probably want a leather backpack. I have slings. I have a vintage, let, let me just show you. I have set up. Let's see. So I have two vintage bags. Okay, so this is a backpack by Tia Neo, and this is a sling. So I have these two, two different styles. <clears throat> I'll show you the backpack since that's what you were asking about. You purchased Sonobo, thanks. Well, thank you, let me check that real quick. All right, thank you so much. I will go ahead and mark her sold. So number 14 has sold. All righty, this is in excellent condition. So you've got this pocket here on the front. Then, and these are getting super hard to find now, so I pick them up when I can. A zipper pocket on the back. I don't know if you're looking for large, if you're looking for small, because this is the only backpack I've got in leather right now. And then, it's got two zippers actually. Here's the label. Neo, right? Yeah. Super clean. This would be a, what do you consider standard? What do you consider medium? What do you consider small? What do you consider large? To me, this is a medium sized backpack. That's what I would consider it being a medium size. It's definitely not a mini because I've sold minis before, but here's what it looks like on. So you be the judge of the size. Okay, that's, I, yeah, you, you let me know what you think the size is. I tell you what I think it is, and then you let me know what you think it is. But it's in excellent condition. And I'll go ahead and do this number 16. Thank you. Okay, so number 16 is going to be the Tia Neo black leather backpack and that's all I'm gonna do today guys so if I have any questions I'd be glad to answer them for you so let me know let me know if you have any questions Thank you everybody for joining so much. And don't forget if you purchase something to make sure on your payment that you add your description of what you purchased. 
and your shipping address. Have a great weekend, everybody. Hope you have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Thank you, Annette. Thank you, Edie. All right, everybody. I will see you on the next video. Have a great one. Bye-bye.